Hey, what's going on? I'm Jason Poole and I'm an industrial designer. I decided to combine my love for fishing and my passion for design. I'm gonna use the 3D Experience SolidWorks for Makers and design and fabricate my very own custom fishing lure right here in my design studio. I like to start most of my projects with a pencil and a piece of paper. This is where I become completely free and just let my imagination run wild. So fishing is something I've done since I was very little. For me, it was a time to spend with family, friends, get outside, get out on the water, and just enjoy mother nature. I was on a recent fishing trip with my kids and I realized something. I've never made my own fishing lure. So what better time than right now? For this particular project, I started off with a handful of sketches, some good, some bad, some really weird, and I narrowed it down to something I really liked. So once I was happy with the concept sketch, I jumped into X-Shape, I started with a box, and just started modeling. I love X-Shape because it reminds me of just working with clay. You know, it's, it's digital sculpting. I just really enjoy seeing the concept sketch come to life in 3D space. All of a sudden it's there and I can see different shapes that I couldn't quite capture with the sketch. Once I was happy with the digital sculpture, I jumped right into SolidWorks Connected and opened up the X-Shape model. Right away I started hammering in all the functional details. SOLIDWORKS has always been my go-to tool for all my engineering and 3D modeling projects. For me, whenever I'm modeling, that's when the project really comes alive. It took a few iterations and prototypes until I came up with the final design. I felt the best way to create this and be able to make it on my 3D printer was to cut the model in half and then dowel pin it back together. I did this so the lure would have a hinge-like mechanism so it could swim gracefully through the water, just like a real fish. I decided to create a few digital color mock-ups. I did this for a couple of reasons. One, it lets me see what colors I like on the lure and two, it helps me formulate a game plan so I know exactly how to paint this. And then I switched over to my airbrush guns and started laying down some paint. By creating my own lure, I can inject some personality into it and make it mine. I want this guy to have a unique style and also an aggressive look and feel. This way, he'll be sure to scare off all the little fish and hopefully attract the giant ones. This whole fishing lure creation process was a lot of fun for me, but technically it is a prototype and I should probably have some more fun and take it out to the lake and see what this lure can do. There we go, we came out here today, we caught a fish. Uh, you know what, it definitely wasn't the biggest fish in my life, but uh, it, was, it was a fish that I caught with a lure that I created. From concept sketch, to 3D model, to 3D printing, then I even got to airbrush it. It was an awesome excuse to come out here, get on the water, and just enjoy nature. Anything's possible with the 3D Experience platform.